forget to close the window. Thanks for visiting NoOutage.com. If you do not like using extension cords with your portable generator during a power outage, there are better options. With a manual transfer switch or transfer panel, you can connect your generator directly to household wiring through your breaker panel. A transfer switch is required by the National Electric Code and prevents dangerous backfeeding to utility power systems. Without this, there is a risk to your generator, home, and anyone near downed power lines. There are basically four ways to install a transfer device. One, use a load side multi-circuit transfer switch. This is actually a box containing four, six, eight, or ten individual transfer switches. Each of these is wired in line to selected branch cir circuits at your breaker panel. This is simple to install and gives individual control of each circuit, whether to power from the utility source or generator. Generally, the transfer switch models that have push button circuit projectors can only be used on branch circuits fed by 15 amp or 20 amp breakers. However, some newer models that have molded case toggle type circuit protectors can be used on branch circuits up to 30 amps. This is large enough to power some big appliances like electric water heaters. The second way is to install a single circuit transfer switch between your electric meter and main load center breaker panel. This must be sized to match your electric service rating. The most common being 200 amps, 120, 240 volt single phase. This type of switch allows you to transfer your whole breaker panel and all its connected branch circuits to your generator. However, you will probably have to switch off some circuits to prevent overloading your generator. This high capacity transfer switch is harder to install because the electric meter must be pulled and heavy service cable must be rerouted and terminated at the switch. If you happen to have a service disconnect at the meter, it won't need to be pulled. A third option is to use a transfer panel installed as a sub-panel. A sub-panel is a small breaker panel that is fed from the upstream main breaker panel. All the branch circuits that need to be powered by the generator must be reconnected to the sub-panel and a large branch breaker must be added to the upstream panel to feed it. Fourth, you can completely replace the standard main breaker panel with a similar transfer panel. Due to the labor involved in disconnecting and removing the existing main breaker panel and replacing it, this option is more attractive for new construction or when an existing service is being upgraded. In all four options, the transfer device will consist of a utility breaker handle interlocked with a generator breaker. Only one of them can be turned on at the same time. The better transfer devices include meters so you can monitor the generator load. Traditional blade type transfer switches also can be used for some of these options, but they are usually more costly. The single generator cord is either plugged directly into the transfer device or it is plugged into a remotely mounted inlet box. Using an inlet box eliminates the need for an open window or door for the generator cord. Please view some of our other video clips and browse our website and contact us if we can be of any assistance. We look forward to hearing from you soon. Are you ready for the next power outage?